Hi, it's Chief Alvarez. We're here at Fire Station 1 uh, for Fire Service Day. We invite everyone in the community to come out. We're doing tours, have an open house at the station. Please come out. We'd love to see you. set up we can communicate with dispatch other agencies uh, emergency situations we have our map where we can pinpoint pull up each incident we maintain accountability right here on the drive board and then translate it up on the TV. Santa Monica has a class one fire department. That means it's the best in the land. And as you can see from station one and fire service day, we're fantastic. Our firefighters, dynamic, trustworthy, great representatives of our city. We're happy you're here. Whether it is going up there for fire or whether it's going up there to lift 
someone up that fell out of bed and can't get up. And believe it or not, it happens a lot. This year. In Santa Monica, what is the what is the tallest building? Twenty stories, one hundred wheelchair. Twenty one stories. Right down on one hundred wheelchair. And that's twenty. Twenty or twenty one. I can't remember. I think it's twenty. And then the one over by Green Park is not quite that tall. Green Park. I'm not sure what building. I'll come out here, I'll sit out here in the sun, I'll have a cup of coffee, I'll FaceTime my wife, I'll FaceTime my baby, and I'll just kind of... You want to see the rest of the station? Come on, I'll show you the rest. Yeah, sure. 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 Yeah, However you provide it is up to you. If you want to order out, because we're having a busy day, maybe we have some training on the schedule and you don't have time to cook, totally up to you. But uh, we do pride ourselves in cooking. We have some really good cooks here. Uh, so a lot of times you'll see us at the grocery store with our shopping cart full of stuff. The calls go off. We have to stop what we're doing and respond to the call. It's just the nature of the business. But um, like I mentioned earlier, we're a big family here. So one of our favorite things to do is to break bread with each other. And this is where all the world's problems are solved the kitchen table and the fire station. Yeah. So whether we're having a cup of coffee or whether we're eating lunch or dinner, we spend a lot of time here. This is a great place for camaraderie. It's a good place to just come and relax. And uh, it's one of the best parts of the fire station. You walk in and someone's cooking for the big house. Uh, out there, we have a smoker, a barbecue grill, and a flat, our black stem, uh, our flat top grill. So you can get pretty creative with your meals. Um, it's always a good day when someone someone good to come here. So this is our kitchen. Any questions so far? You know, I like to mix it up. I try not to cook the same thing twice in a row. So, um, you know, one of my favorite dinners is shrimp, chicken, basil, pesto, pasta with a ton of veggies. Asparagus, squash, mushrooms, onions, basil, pesto, a little side salad. Uh, for lunch, I like to do a big Mediterranean chicken salad and uh, maybe like a side of some fruit. And then when I'm just like, I don't know what to cook, I go to my old bagel, double cheeseburgers. I work in and out for 10 years. So that's my bread and butter. And uh, some sweet potato fries. You gotta have a couple things in your arsenal, you know? Yeah. Believe it or not, we do have one trick ponies here. They got one meal and that's all they do, but hey, God bless them. So yeah, we do our best. Uh, you guys follow me this way and I'll show you this side of the station. I have a question for the kiddos. Who who cleans the fire station? Uh, we're the cleaners. The firefighters do. Uh, we maintain we maintain our station. We do daily chores, cleaning the heads, the toilets, making sure the floors are clean. Hey Jeff, how much? 20? 2-0? 20. 20. We're kind of redoing it right now, so it's a little bit cramped, but...
Have you warmed up in the fire